As NEA intensifies its effort to curb mosquito breeding over the years, mosquitoes have also been adapting and have begun breeding in more obscure and hard to find places. To seek them out, a new tool is needed and male Wolbachia carrying Aedes mosquitoes could be just what we are looking for. After years of studies and risk assessment on various novel control tools at the Environmental Health Institute, NEA has identified and shown the potential of using only male Wolbachia carrying Aedes aegypti mosquitoes to suppress the Aedes aegypti population in Singapore. Hi Abby. Hi Christina. What are you doing here? I'm picking mosquito pupae. Oh I see, there's so many pupae in here. You're sorting between the males and the females? Male mosquito pupae are smaller than female pupae, thus they can be sorted by size. After sorting, the male pupae are allowed to emerge as adult mosquitoes, which are then ready to do their job, mate with urban females and cause the eggs to be non-viable. Since 2012, EHI has been carrying out risk assessment and laboratory studies to confirm that Wolbachia is safe and that its desirable properties are retained when it is transferred to the local strain of Aedes aegypti. Firstly, Wolbachia is extracted from Aedes albopictus, another black and white mosquito species commonly found in Singapore. The bacterium is then introduced into Aedes aegypti eggs via microinjection causing mosquitoes that emerge to carry the bacterium. As Wolbachia is passed on from female Wolbachia aedes to their offspring, these females are used to rear subsequent generations of Wolbachia aedes aegypti. Whilst the females are used for generating more Wolbachia aedes aegypti, the males are useful for aedes aegypti population control. Studies conducted at EHI have indeed shown that there were no viable eggs and no offspring when male Wolbachia Aedes aegypti mated with female urban Aedes aegypti with no Wolbachia. The Wolbachia Aedes technology is a potential complementary tool in Singapore's dengue control program and it is critical for all stakeholders to continue to do their part to prevent dengue. Let's remain vigilant and fight dengue together as a community to keep our loved ones safe. <laughs>